automatically pump back to one of the tanks, the tanks that they selected in the cellars and in the brew house. We'll come back to the tank. Before it's pumped back, we'll pitch the tank with yeast. Once the tank is pitched with yeast, the wort will mix with yeast. That's where you get your alcohol, and that's where it starts producing CO2. Uh, that's where the whole process starts. This, with the tanks, these are all jacketed. You see about a two inch on the top, that's all glycol. It's jacketed with glycol, it's basically a food grade antifreeze. And on the sides, uh, let's see, see them, but you can see the glycol pipe coming down, that's a return pipe. Here's the supply pipe on this side. You have a control valve, analog signal, control valve. That's an analog output, and then you have two analog inputs, which are the RTDs. So based on the temperature, your sub point, and your process variable, we'll control the control valve to try to reach the set point. That's where you get into PID tuning, overshooting, undershooting, and try to tune it right in. What I've done to compensate for PID tuning is I clamp the valve. So on the lower ends, because when you have a mass this big, 8,300 gallons, you don't want to overshoot because your overshooting can be a day later yeah. or two days later. So what you want to do is you clamp your PID so it's only the output's only 15%, then you're controlling it within that, back and forth. Uh, again, all the tanks jacketed with glycol. Not a lot going on here. Two uh, uh, probes, RTDs on the side. Each recipe has different steps. So when it comes out here, we have a rice step, we have a ferment step, we have a de-rest step, we have a main pool pool, and then we have a maintain. Maintain, we bring it down to minus 0.5 degrees C. So it's bringing it down pretty cold. And what that does is that cuts the yeast off. So that's how you stop the yeast from growing. It cuts it off, and then they pump it out, they'll filter it, then they'll, pitch, they'll take that yeast, bring it to another tank. Use it, I think, eight times, and then they throw it away. So that, that valve uh, isn't the best spot to work on. So it's uh, not a lot going on. Oh. 